hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel thank you for tuning in where everything is good with this so i'm going to do a general um take what resonates if you come across this video please subscribe share if you will and like and comment especially if it resonates so i'm just gonna read off energy that i feel today I've done a few on TikTok already this morning. Um, if you all will follow sincerely underscore um, De Desi. Sincerely underscore Desi. So, let's get this party started. Spirit shots. Oh, we already got one card. We have despair. What do we need to know for today? For the collective. Victory. The Empress. All right, so somebody's in a good headspace today. Um, they've gained a lot, conquered, maybe achieved a few of their goals, maybe in the month of October. Um, I feel like this is a feminine energy maybe a single mother who has a child or kids. Um, they went through a lot in despair. Um, I wanna, the energy that I'm getting, and I'm gonna be honest, and I hate talking about stuff like this, maybe abusive relationship. Let's see what else. We have the high priestess. Y'all can see that. So yes, this woman's definitely standing on her own two feet now. Um, I felt like she was living in a nightmare. Yeah, she torment. I feel like this person was definitely in a in an abusive relationship. She got out of it. She won. Whoever this resonates with, you won because you got out of this situation and um. You gained a lot. You start seeing your blessings by leaving this situation. You was definitely blocking blessings and stuff by being in this relationship. Is the energy that I'm getting. You felt, um, you felt like a slave in your relationship. Maybe you, this car popped up, yeah. You have a lot to work on still. You got a lot of healing to do. Don't you dare jump into another relationship. You bad not, father of fire. There's going to be a man that's going to try to walk into your life and he ain't going to be good either. So that next man is a no-go for you. you. You definitely got a lot to work on. You need to heal. Plus, that's the father of fire. So that, that card, I feel like, resonates with like a man controlling, manipulative, maybe a narcissist. Um, I hope you read those signs. Ace of Water. You're definitely trying to find peace here. You want a family. I don't think you're ready for one, though. You're quite traumatized. We have mother of fire. Yeah. I feel like this is a single mother. This is resonating with. What else? Daughter of air. So maybe you have a daughter. You have a daughter that's been through a lot too. This is the energy that I'm picking up. Um, you're standing alone. We got that. I can't pronounce that word, so don't, 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 don't have me try to say it because I won't. <laughs> but y'all yeah, get the picture. Um, yeah, this woman's definitely standing on her own two feet. You got victory. You gained a lot. Maybe you're learning a lot about yourself since you left this previous relationship interference yeah he was definitely blocking a lot of blessings for you he was no good for you or the kids very toxic maybe he was very controlling maybe he was a lazy ass person too he was using you at one point he did care about you but he, he never intended to be solid and faithful and change his ways. I feel like this person was an alcoholic. Mm. Illusion. 
yeah um you finally came to the conclusion that he wasn't right for you you can't take it no more this relationship brought you in a deep hole maybe something really bad happened to where he was very abusive and like the last time y'all had fall or he had put your hand his hands on you that made you realize that you had to get out of it for the sake of yourself and also for your kids because um your kids you are the only people you know person that your kids have this is the energy yeah you went through a lot in this relationship maybe you, you try to do some drugs or maybe you got high light You try to cope with with the situation that you were in reflection so yeah you actually finding peace right now you're trying to heal trying to learn how to heal you want a better path i will say just don't backtrack don't go back to that person and even the next person that's that's trying to um take you out go out on a, a date or try to build a relationship with you don't because i feel like that next person is going to be toxic so maybe the person after that or the person after that yeah, that was definitely the end of your relationship with that person. Um, this The death card resonates with something, the start of something new, definitely. Because um, something is ending, which is that relationship. of earth yes so there's definitely i feel like a man has been watching you and that next man that's going to try to reach out to you is definitely a fucking user do not feed into it i am just a messenger most definitely what else jesus That one wants to pop up bravery yeah see oh we got two cards we got the bravery father of air so yeah um bravery most definitely you fall through this shit you got through it you do not want to look back don't look back and then we have father of air here which i feel like that's just a you know you're calm um you're trying to be at peace but don't know how you sitting here and you're thinking Maybe you're thinking, like, why did I put myself through this um, situation? Why did I go through this? But let me tell you this. People go through stuff to learn and to grow and to elevate. We got the hangman here. Oops. We got the hangman here. So, yeah, you was definitely in a hole in this relationship. Um, maybe you thought about suicide. That, that's the energy that I'm picking up with that card. You were suicidal in this relationship. Will this person trying to reach out to you i feel like you took an epo out on this person yeah all over the place maybe you guys are in and out in and out of court or um something like that or maybe he's trying to see his kids and you trying to take an epo out because he's just no good he did more damage than good most definitely i feel like you guys were together for some years whoever this is um we have the emperor yeah so like you're this is you sitting on your throne like i can't be touched that's the energy and that is a good outlook because once you keep that mindset especially when you have gotten out of a deep hole out of a, an abusive relationship um you in your mind you have um no one has access to me i want this i want that but no one really has access to me because i don't want to be hurt again i don't want to go through the, sh the bullshit that i went through we have the deception here <coughs> most definitely maybe somebody's helping you um heal um like a counselor or maybe maybe looking at your kids every day you realize you know that your kids are helping you heal 
it's just you and your kids against the world and that's sometimes that's how you have to look at it you feeding them you looking at it like i have to feed my kids i live for my kids i don't live for no man that's the mindset that you need to have whoever this person is we have the ace of earth so yeah you came to the conclusion that you're never going to go back to that person a little hurt but i feel like you're not that hurt you're just more so upset at yourself that you wasted time you thought that he was going to change and he didn't and wasn't and he won't and honestly he's going to be worse for the next person comfort you actually found comfort for you and your kids maybe you guys moved moved out of town out of state this resonates please comment we have the lovers card that pop up but i'm not getting good energy from that like i said the next person that's trying to reach out to you or trying to date you are going to use you as well i try to use you as well you don't need to backtrack at all any red flags they gotta go again i'm just a messenger so daughter of water yes so maybe you have a daughter that looks up to you um she she feels alone most definitely temperance yeah she she's standing alone um maybe she has a lot to talk about she don't know how to come to you she's traumatized so she probably seen you go through a lot she's scared Sorry, y'all, my nose is burning. I uh, will be going live soon. So please subscribe so when I go live, I can do readings. I will take donations. I'm trying to build my content up, so. Follow, follow, follow. Yeah, so you've gained a lot by leaving this person. Um, and actually with this, I, the energy that I'm picking up, you're starting over so you're starting a new life so it's pretty much like planting a seed and just pretty much waiting for that flower to grow you're gonna be bomb girl whoever this is i hope it resonates with somebody so what else Think nothing else wants to pop up. <laughs> I don't think nothing else wants to pop up. That's probably how you needed to know. That main thing is the game, what you've gained from this relationship. Yeah, success. You definitely um, on your way to success right now, into reaching your goals. Maybe it's financially. You're trying to re reach, you know, the moon yeah this this relationship definitely took a toll on you um you still think about it you still think about it and that's okay but don't ever go back to that person do not yeah the hermit um he was definitely a damaged man i felt like he was probably you know demonic in some way and some people just won't ever change some people really don't like that for the rest of their life <clears throat> so i'm glad you got out that situation he's gonna be old and bitter and angry at the world and he's gonna blame everybody for his problems but his own self which is sad what else domination yeah you definitely conquered everything that you needed to conquer all I can say, keep moving forward. Keep doing what you're doing. Do not jump into the next relationship because like I said, the next person is going to try to use you as well. He might not be an abuser, but he's definitely going to use you because the shit that you got going on and the shit that you're about to accomplish. So if this resonates, please comment and I will see you guys.